guys, welcome back to my channel. It's Lauren. Today I'm going to be doing a sorority slash dorm room haul. So if you're new to my channel, I will be a sophomore at the University of Alabama and I will be living in my sorority house this year and I'm a part of Pi Beta Phi there. So if you're like me and you love watching back to school videos, I have a ton on my channel. I have a ton of hauls and shop with me videos from this year. I also have move in and move out videos, room tours, and even a whole entire rush series if you are going through sorority recruitment. So before we get any further, I want to go ahead and thank the sponsor for the video, which is Wondershare and their PDF Element feature. So their PDF Element is an all-in-one PDF solution that is available for Mac and Windows, so they can convert PDFs into Word documents, PPTs, Excel images, and many, many more. To me, this is a huge essential for college. I cannot tell you how many times my freshman year I had to change something from a PDF to something else or vice versa. First thing I'm going to show you is how to add a signature while using this software. So you're going to be going up here to markup and you will see right over here a signature you can add in your own signature and wherever you want the signature you will just click on the page and you can make it larger smaller I know this is a bad signature don't hate on me so let's say you want to save this PDF as an image you're going to go over to the tool option and then to the PDF converter once you click that you can see format right here I already have it set to an image they're going to drag your file here so I'm just going to drag it click apply save and then there you go it is set as an image I'll be leaving you a free download link in my description box down below for you to go check that out and download for your high school or college uses or even your everyday work life. Okay, so I'm so, so excited to show you my stuff. Okay, so if you watched my sorority room shop with me video, you knew that I got a ton, a ton of baskets. I promise this will all make sense whenever I do my room tour. I am planning on doing a move-in vlog. A ton of you guys have been DMing me on Instagram asking me if I was doing a move-in vlog and girls, of course I am. I I love watching move-in vlogs and I think this year is going to be super super special and I cannot wait to share it with you but these baskets they have a reason why I have like a plethora of baskets I promise also this stuff might not go together in your head and honestly I don't know if it's gonna go together in my room I'm hoping and I have a vision I'm trying to like kind of make it look kind of different come back for my room tour or like my move-in vlog and you'll get like an idea of what I'm doing <laughs> So I'm just going to jump right in because I don't have anything categorized at all. I haven't started shopping for anything yet. So this is the first thing that I have and it is this massive pillow. This is an oatmeal and tan color and it's also white kind of, I don't know, it's really texturized. You will notice a ton of the things that I've gotten are very texturized. I'm really into that right now. I got this at TJ Maxx for, I got it on sale for $20. It is just this pillow that I got from my bed and then it has these cute little tassels on the bottom. Okay, so I have another thing of pillows. I'm just gonna go ahead and grab them. And there are these mauve color. I got these also at TJ Maxx. Let's see how much they were. These were $30, but I mean, it came in a pack of two. So both were like 15. So I feel like that wasn't that bad, um, but they are pretty massive pillows. They are so, so nice. I love them. I really wanted to splurge on some pillows because the pillows I got for my freshman year dorm didn't really care about the quality of them because I thought, oh, I'm just gonna be using them for one year, which I did but I mean, I really couldn't use them another year. So I splurged on some nice pillows. Okay, so the next thing I got is from Walmart and it is this 10 shelf closet organizer. So basically it just like holds your shoes. It just kind of like hangs and holds your shoes. I don't know if I'm gonna need this, but I got it just in case because it wasn't that expensive. Okay, next I have this basket and it is this gold wired basket. I am planning on using this for blankets and having this be kind of like a blanket basket. A blanket basket. <laughs> That's so cute. Wait, this is my blanket basket. Let's see how many times Lauren can say blanket basket in a video. This was $16 at at home. I think this is going to be really, really cute. I have a ton of already texturized blankets that I didn't buy for my dorm that I bought in the beginning of quarantine, you know, since we were stuck at home. That is going to look super duper cute in here. And I think once I like kind of lay them over and make it cute we're gonna be we're gonna be doing good next thing is from TJ Maxx also and it is this month at a glance so normally I hate these and I don't know if I'm going just to like have a change of heart and like it this was $7.99 oh it's from home goods it's basically the same thing if I say home goods and it's from TJ Maxx just know like it's basically the same thing that way I can just change this out month to month and keep track of whether that be like my YouTube schedule or my school schedule or anything like that I just felt like it was a necessity and I feel like it gave something else on the wall that was really inexpensive also okay so going into some of the baskets so this basket is I don't know what this is is this wicker this isn't wicker 
if you know the material of this please let me know because i have a ton of stuff like this and i feel so bad because i don't know the material this is made out of but this is one of the baskets and it just opens up like that this is kind of a grandma thing but i vibe with it so i got it the next basket is this white wooden one both of these baskets are from tj maxx i love this it has like a covering in the middle um so like you can't see your stuff there you just see like the little canvas i got numerous sizes of these i wanted my baskets to match but not be like matchy matchy like i wanted them to be like those are different baskets but they go together you know what i mean i think i bought one bigger and then i think two of these sizes and maybe one smaller because they were all like in stock at tj maxx and i absolutely love them then i got this basket and this was from ross i believe i think i took the sticker off but i think this is like 5.99 or 4.99 something crazy but it kind of goes with the one that i showed you earlier from tj maxx and it just looks like this then i got this acrylic palette organizer so i have actually been looking for this like crazy and couldn't find it anywhere i got this at home goods for $12.99 I don't have a lot of makeup palettes but I do have enough where I would need this but I'm still going to have like areas in this that aren't full of makeup palettes if that makes sense but of course I get shows like you can use like perfume or lipstick or whatever but I really like the acrylic look I already have a ton of acrylic storage that I'm planning on bringing with me but I didn't have an acrylic palette organizer so I went ahead and got this at home goods then I got this wallpaper and my mom saw this wallpaper and she was like why does it look like a Dalmatian? And okay, I'm telling you guys, you have to trust me. You have to trust me. Even my roommate for this year, Rachel, she asked me what I was doing with my side of the room and I told her and it wasn't making sense to her. And she was like, I kind of want to do the same thing, but I don't know how it's going to look. And I'm like, Rachel, trust me on this. Okay, honey, we're going to have a good room whenever my mind figures out what it actually is. I have big hopes for this, big hopes and dreams for this wallpaper and... It's going to be an accent wall and it's going to be adorable. You guys just wait. You guys are going to be like, wow, Lauren, you have such a cute room. Be like, remember those who doubted me? I would be confused too if I was watching a video and I just saw a girl buy baskets and wallpaper. I'd be like... Then I got this plant. I have a ton of plants that I am reusing from last year, but I loved how green this was. I really want to do like pops of like greenery, vinery. I don't really know. Like I said, my mind's kind of jumbled. It looks good in my head. Um, this is at TJ Maxx and it was $6.99. Oh, these I got off of Amazon, if you're curious. Anything that I can link for you, I will be linking down below, but a ton of this stuff, as you can probably tell already, is from TJ Maxx. But what I can link for you, I will. Okay, so this is gonna be kind of weird to show you, but I got this nightstand table and it's not really, I don't think it's supposed to be used as a nightstand table, maybe it is. It's gold and it has these really pretty legs on it and then it is mirrored at the very top. I don't know if you can tell that it's a mirror, but it is a gorgeous side table. The next thing I'm going to be showing you is my bedspread. So this I got at target.com. I don't know if they sell it in stores. I don't think they do, but I will show you like the front of it from like this little picture. I don't know if you can really tell, but it has all these different textures on it and all these cute ruffles. Excited. I think this is gonna be really good. The reviews online weren't that good, but like I have big hopes. I have high hopes for this. You know, I love a good white bedspread. Okay, so these two things I made, but like I kind of custom made them. So I will show you and then I'll explain it. I made one for me and one for Rachel because Rachel, my roommate, decided that she wanted to do basically the same thing that I was doing to my side of the room as best as she could and like what she could find and everything because I went ahead and bought a ton of stuff just because I honestly didn't think she'd want to match me. I don't know. But I made these for above our bed and it just says Pi Beta Phi and it is like a wooden hanger. It kind of reminds me of those, like those wooden hangers that you would have on like a front door. If you're from the South, I don't know if you do this up north but down south they have like these wooden hangers and like it'll be like watermelons for summer and like footballs and it's like really cute or the stuff that is hanging on a baby's door whenever like someone has a baby and like it has like their weight and everything if you know what i'm talking about you know but i kind of messed these up so this piece of wood was an individual purchase and then i had them cut out the pi beta phi so it is kind of 3d if you you probably can't tell that's okay i wanted it to look more weathered like the white to be more worn like that white basket but my chalk paint was not doing like i wanted it to so i had to put on two layers of chalk paint and then i couldn't sand it off so i don't really know what to do with it right now it's just a white circle and i don't know if i approve or not next 
you guessed it, our baskets. These are from at home and these were also $30 and they just look like this. I feel like this is a mix between both of those baskets I have already shown you. This is a pack of two, one smaller and then one bigger one. Literally fell in love with these baskets when I saw them but we're kind of in denial. Literally, I was in love with those baskets whenever I saw them at at home, but they were very, very expensive, but I caved in and I got them and I'm so happy I did. Okay, so something that I didn't bring in here is my TV. So I didn't purchase a TV. My brother actually gave it to me, but it's a brand new TV that he never even opened. It's like a small one. It's like a 30 something inch. I don't really know the sizes of TVs, but he got me one. So I went ahead and bought a Roku for it. That way I can watch like Hulu and Netflix and Disney Plus everything that I want in my room. In PiFi, we have areas where we can watch TV in the house, which is really nice. But those days where I don't really want to go down there and I just want to watch TV by myself, I have that option now. And I've never owned a Roku. Let me know if you've owned a Roku. Is this a, is this a good purchase? A ton of people I know have a Roku, so I kind of just caved in. I was like, seems bougie, so I'm getting it. Next is another basket. I know you guys are probably hating me. They're like, this is the basket girl. It's fine. I'm, I'm perfectly okay with being known as the basket girl. Um, but this I got at Hobby Lobby. I don't know where these, I did not take these tags off. I think this was like $13 to $15, I think. Um, but it has these cute little tassels on it. And after I shopped for this, someone was like, you know, you can just buy a cheaper basket and then just like glue this on. And I'm like, that's such a great hack that I didn't know whenever I bought this $15 basket. If you're in the same predicament as me and you love baskets, do it and let me know how it works. Okay, so moving right along, I got this lamp from Target. This was $10 and this isn't off-white. It's like a light, light gray color, oatmeal color. I've been obsessed with the color oatmeal or just saying the color oatmeal, not really the color, but it is just this really simple lamp. I'm planning on using this at my desk because I don't really like my desk lamp that I have from last year and I'm hoping this is going to work since it's like so miniature. I also got these pack of charters off Amazon. They are just three and I think they're like six foot cables. I don't really know how long they are, but they're pretty long and they just came in a pack of white, gold, and pink. All of my favorite colors. Okay, so these are my sheets. I took them out because I personally like to wash my sheets before moving like that way I don't have to do like laundry or anything but basically there are these light pink sheets and then I also have my gray sheets from last year that I might keep as a backup really just hoping just to keep these there's really no point to have two pairs of sheets next I bought some greenery I know trust me on my room okay so these are strands and kind of like it's kind of a garland of vines if that makes sense I don't really know it's artificial ivy so there we go. That's what this is. Okay, so we have a cork board in the Pi Fi room that you cannot take down. It's like already like mounted up on the wall. So I decided to get some push pins for it. I got these really pretty leopard ones or jaguar. I don't know what this is, but they're super cute. This is just what they look like. I have been forgetting to tell you where my stuff is. My sheets are from Amazon, the Ivy's from Amazon, and then this is from Hobby Lobby. This is $2.99. And then for the bulk of the cork board, I got these. These are from Target. I don't really remember how much they were. I think they were like $5. Something crazy for push pins, but they're gold and it's like a little heart shape. That is the front. And then that kind of gives you a better idea of what the push pins look like. Then I got this cosmetic drawer organizer thing I found this on tiktok this is definitely a tiktok find but i bought it off of amazon but basically it is just like a rotating shelf kind of thing where i can keep skincare and makeup and really anything i want to in this little thing then i got this shiplap fabric so this is a very very thin fabric and i'm planning on covering the cork board with this fabric not the whole entire cork board like where it looks weird but the actual cork of it you know like how teachers in elementary school they would put paper over the cork board kind of wanted to do that sort of feel but with fabric and i think this is going to be really really nice i got this fabric at hobby lobby and i think it might have cost me like four dollars for a yard then i got this blanket right here and it's kind of hard to show but it's kind of like a hair bone pattern and it is the mauve color a white color and it has like gold little flecks in it 
And then it also has tassels at the bottom. Okay, so one last box to go through. While I'm thinking about it, I also bought a rug and it is a white rug. I'm not going to unravel it right now for a video, but it is just a plain white rug. I got a five by seven rug for my room. Then I also got a mirror. So I'll also insert the picture of the mirror here because I always love having a vanity mirror at my desk. My desk is always doubled as a vanity. I've always been that girl, but I found this off of Amazon and it was a pretty good price for what I was looking for. I have one already but I hated having to move it back and forth. I did come home a lot last year just because I live two hours away from the University of Alabama and my boyfriend lives here. I'm really close to my family and I have a niece and nephew here so it just makes sense for me to kind of come home when I can and spend time with them and I absolutely hated having to pack up this stupid mirror because I would always forget it and so I'm just going to leave one in Pi Phi and then one in my room. Okay then I have these two baskets but these are going to go in my vanity. I think these are going to be the right size. We don't really have exact dimensions of the basket we kind of needed but they have two kind of cubbies in the built-in vanity this will all make sense later i promise come back and check but they just have these three different containers and since it's going to be in my vanity i think this is going to be really really nice for the storage i loved how they had the dividers in it i got these at at home and they were eight dollars a piece then i found this cute little thing at tj maxx i believe yes but i don't know how much it was because i ripped off the price tag i think it was like seven dollars five or seven dollars i believe but I'm planning on using these for my pencils and pens and markers, coloring stuff, everything that I need for my desk area. I think it's really cute. I think it kind of went with the vibe and yeah, that's pretty much it. They're just super duper cute. <laughs> I promise this is the last basket. <laughs> Look, is this isn't really even a basket. It's not really even a basket. I plan on using this for like my cords. Like not obviously big cords, but like the extra phone cords and my Roku remote, anything tech related that I need next to my bedside. I do a lot of editing from my bed late at night and so I think this is going to be really nice for extra SD cards, my battery charger for my camera, and you know everything that I would need really close. I mean this is really really tiny and I intended it to be really tiny. I got this at Hobby Lobby for four dollars. This is a seat cushion that I bought off of Amazon. Um, I ordered the pink and they sent me the white. I'm not upset about it but Rachel and I were supposed to match and now we really can't because they sent me the wrong color but but it's okay, it works out. Then I bought myself a new fan. I have a fan already, it is a black fan, but it kind of stopped working. It still fans. Yeah, fans fan. Yeah, whatever. But it is not this large and it's been a hot second since I bought it. So it's very, very old and I just felt a vamp up. So this was her. Got it off Amazon. And the last item in this haul is a new laundry basket. So I decided to get this laundry basket. This is just from Target. I believe this was like eight or nine dollars or something. It also comes with a divider at the bottom. So like you can pop it up if you want to put whites in one side and darks in one side or whatever you want to do. I think this is going to fit very, very very nicely in the Pi Fi closet that we have. But that was my sorority room slash dorm room haul. I hope you guys enjoyed it and I hope that you come back to watch my move-in vlog and my room tour. I promise it will be worth the wait and it'll be worth you coming back. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, be sure to give it a big thumbs up and if you want to join the family, you can click that subscribe button also. I love you guys so much and I'll be seeing you in my next video. Bye!